hi, Rihanna. Thank you for sending in your question to Snap Math. We thought you might be able to use this in a different way, so we decided to show you how to do this in a two column proof. So, the first thing you want to do is you want to start with your given. So, the first is going to be MA and TH are parallel. And the reason is given. And then we're going to write the other given down, 1 and angle 2 are congruent, also this is given, so this is congruent to that, and this is, or is parallel to that. So now, what we want to show is that M and A are congruent. And to do that, we're going to show that 2 and A are supplementary. So angle 2 and angle A are supplementary. The reason is consecutive interior angles are supplementary. So if we bring this out with the parallel lines, so a par two parallel lines cut by a transversal, the consecutive interior angles are going to be supplementary. So we go on to our next statement. We're going to say that M and 1 are supplementary. And it's the same reason. Two par parallel lines cut by a transversal, the alternate or the consecutive interior angles are supplementary. So we'll write that. And angle 1 are supplementary. And this is the same reason. Interior angles, consecutive interior angles are supplementary. And finally, we can prove this. So we'll go with what we're trying to prove. We'll put that as our statement. So we start with our given and end with what we're trying to prove. And the reason is it's a theorem that we've learned in the past that angles that are supplementary to congruent angles are also congruent. And there's our proof. We pro proved that M and A are congruent on a two-column proof. So thank you for choosing math, snap math, and we look forward to answering your questions in the future, Rihanna.